Hi everyone, my name is Mike Bryan and today I'm happy to have Cassie Riffey here today from the Oaks at Bethesda and the Oaks at North Point. Uh, she is the Director of Marketing and Admissions at um, both places. And so thanks very much for coming today. I yeah, uh, appreciate my pleasure. having you. Thank you for having me. You're welcome, you're welcome. And uh, first things first, um, everyone wants to know where you are located. Um, so uh, the address for both uh, uh, facilities, if you would. Yeah, so the Oaks at North Point is located at 3291 uh, North Point Drive here in Zanesville. Um, and then the Oaks at Bethesda is located at 2971 Maple Avenue, um, right behind uh, Genesis Hospital. And what's the best phone number for them to get in contact with you? Uh, the best one for North Point is 740-452-3000, and the one for Bethesda is 740-452-3800. And if someone would like to email you, what's an email address? Um, it's just my name, so it's Cassandra Riffey at oaksatbethesda.com. Um, and that you can reach me really at any time, any day with that, if you have any questions. And I know Trilogy's website, it's basically trilogyhs.com, but yep. they can go to communities and they can find, Yep. Um, and they can also do a Google search, I assume, as yep, well. Yep, absolutely. So if they just put in there the Oaks at Bethesda or the Oaks at North Point, um, they will find us right there under the Trilogy Health Services, um, and it will direct you. If you have um, you know, any questions or what you're looking for, it'll direct you right to there, which goes right to me, actually. Okay. So. All right. Yeah. Well, good to know. So, you know, when someone is calling in, um, you're typically one of the, the first contacts, but then it may go to other folks. Can you explain how that would work? Yeah. So um, I have a wonderful team that I work with. Um, I have two guest relations. So the guest relations um, at Oaks at Bethesda is Stacy Barnett. Um, and then the guest relations at Oaks at North Point is Stephanie Swindrick. Um, and then I also do have a CSS who really focuses on our community events and our assisted living needs, um, and her name is Michelle Bowie. Okay. And CSS, just for folks who hear that, I'm not sure what that means. It, what is CSS? Customer Service Specialist. Okay. All right. And so uh, quite a few folks that they can uh, be in contact with. Now, with each facility, you have kind of a similar layout. Can you describe that? There's assisted living and the health center side. Yeah, so we really have a continuing of care um, at both campuses. So we do offer um, assisted living health center and then at the North Point campus, we offer a memory care unit. Um, it is a secure unit um, that is designed for dementia patients. Um, but both of them really have the same type of layout. Um, Bethesda is a little bit smaller of a campus, whereas North Point is a little bit bigger, um, but both do have the same service lines other than that memory care unit. Okay. okay. Now, if someone is visiting um, either the Oaks at North Point or the Oaks at Bethesda, what should they expect you know when they when they come out and they would like to take a tour for example what should they expect um so they'll be greeted and they'll sit down with either myself michelle uh stacy or stephanie and we'll we'll just kind of sit down in a room um and have a conversation about what their needs are and who they're looking for or what they're looking for uh we want to we want to figure out you know what is their what's their goal here you know are they looking for um surgery right after rehab, rehab right after surgery, sure. um, or are they looking for, you know, some place long term for their loved one, maybe they're kind of struggling at home, or, you know, really just trying to narrow down what their needs are. Um, once we kind of get that figured out, we'll give them a tour of the campus and show them, you know, all the service lines, because we want them to be able to see the entire campus as a whole. Um, we'll kind of then sit back down with them and go over, you know, any questions with them that they might have after the tour. Um, you know, we really, we want it to be inviting and welcoming. We also try to introduce them to either, you know, the director of health services, um, you know, if they're concerned or, you know, their questions are with therapy, we try to get them in front of a therapist just so they're kind of putting some faces in with, you know, the people that are there. Cause that's really what sets us apart is, is our staff. So now I understand that, that they have semi-private and private rooms available. Yeah. Yep. Okay. Yep. At both campuses. Okay. Now, what are some of the, the items or, or programs or, or things that you think sets you guys apart from others? You know, really, I think, um, I really think our staff alone really is what sets us apart. You know, we, we really have amazing staff members from leadership, you know, all the way down, you know, to our dietary services, um, environmental. We, we look at people when we bring them in 
what kind of heart that they have. We, we look for people with a servant's heart. Mm-hmm. Um, so that for me is what really sets us apart, you know, and program wise, our activities department is just amazing. They go above and beyond with mm-hmm. our residents. Um, you know, they listen to different conversations that they're having, you know, at the dinner table of what they're wanting to do or what they've liked to do in the past. And, you know, we, we had residents go down a slip and slide, you know, and, and it was just amazing to hear what memories brought that back. Um, we had residents go zip lining. Um, just, we had them go to a baseball game because, and it's just so many different things that we do for our residents. And those are some of the bigger things that we do, but on a weekly basis, you know, they go shopping or they get to go to dinner with each other. And those are just things that we're trying to improve their quality of life. Um, and to me, that's, that's amazing. That's what we're there for is to improve their quality of life. Um, and then our therapy department is, is truly amazing. They're very strong. Um, they've been together for a really long time. The directors have both been there since I think the openings of the building. Okay. Um, so a lot of longevity there and they just, they work very well together. You know, they figure out what that goal is and they work as hard and as fast as they can, you know, to get that resident feeling better and what their best is. So those are the things for me that really set Trilogy apart. Okay. So, you know, after someone, they've, they've taken the tour, they've, they've talked with you, other members of your team, and they've decided this is the place they want to go. Um, what are the next steps then? I assume they're going to have to sign an agreement, and yeah. they'll, they would have talked to you about pricing and all that. Yep. Um, explain that, please. So, um, w- when they're ready to make that decision, um, if they are coming from home, really the three things that we need are a history and physical from their primary care doctor, mm-hmm. um, a medication list, and an order to admit. Um, that's really my job and my focus is to be able to work with the physicians in the area to make that a very smooth transition. You know, I, I will call them and let them know this is what we're looking for. Um, we actually fax them a paper, they write it all on there. So those are really the biggest things that they need. Um, when they come into tour, we give them a packet of information and um, goes over, you know, what to expect and what they're looking at. Um, you know, and of course, if they have any other questions after that, you know, we will sit down after and do paperwork with them and goes over the entire agreement all over again. And that gives them another chance once they go home and they come back. If they have any more questions, we're sitting down again to go over that with them. Okay. And of course, if they have questions about the paperwork, they can take that with them. They can review it at home. You know, we'll have questions lots of times at, you know, there's, at, at any place, there's a lot of paperwork to review, and oh, yeah. it can be overwhelming when a loved one needs care. And so, um, I always want to bring that up that you can take it with you. you Absolutely, know, so. you can always take it with you. And then, um, even afterward, you know, we print everything off for you because you know nowadays everything is electronic. But mm-hmm. we print it off with you, and if you have any other questions at that point, too, you know, bring it back in, and we'll go back over it. Now, when folks are looking at um, how to pay for their care. Um, they can use veterans benefits through the pension program. Yes. They can use Medicaid, Medicare, other insurances perhaps. Yep. Um, those are the common ways they'll pay. Yep. Okay. Yep. Those are, those are all that we take. Okay. Yeah. Well, anything else that you, you'd want to share with folks for, um, you know, you know, trying to understand a little bit about both Oaks at Bethesda and Oaks at North Point. You know, we really just offer you, we want you to come in and take a tour of it. Um, you know, once you see what we're doing and how we do it and what the facility looks like, you know, we really feel like that that's going to help ease some people's minds. You know, we, we realize that there's no place like home, you know, but coming in and seeing, you know, the campus, it's a very beautiful campus. It's a very warm campus. You're going to walk through the halls and people are going to say hi to you and the residents are going to talk to you and the staff members are going to talk to you. And it's really, you know, we really just encourage, if even if you're not looking right now, you know, come out and take a tour of it and just see what we're offering. Um, it's, it's truly an amazing thing. And the way of nursing homes, if you will, has really mm-hmm. changed now. Um, it's, it's a different way. So, you know, I really just encourage you to come out and take a tour and, and meet us. All right. Well, again, if folks have any other questions, um, certainly reach out to, to Cassie and she can get you to the correct person. Um, but thanks again for coming here today. I appreciate Absolutely. all the information and hopefully it can be helpful for everyone. So. Thank you. Thank thanks. you so much. Have a great day.